I was in Indianola a few months ago and I was talking to someone who works at the Department of Public Welfare here and she told me that the state of Iowa is going to get fined if they don't sign up more people under the Medicaid program. They're just pushing harder and harder to get more and more of you dependent upon them so they can get your vote. That's what the bottom line is. I don't want to, to make li people's lives better by giving them somebody else's money. I was the stupidest kid in the wall. All right, I was a real thug. You know, I was up in uh, Harlem a few weeks ago, and I actually had dinner with uh, Al Sharpton, who is a very, very interesting guy. And he comes on a factor a lot. And then I treated him to dinner um, because he's made himself available to us, and I felt that I wanted to take him up there. And we went to Sylvia's, a very famous restaurant in Harlem. I had a great time, and uh, all the people up there tremendously respectful. They all watched the factor. Uh, you know, and Sharpton, I walked in, it was like big commotion and everything, but everybody was very nice. And I couldn't get over the fact that there was no difference between Sylvia's restaurant and any other restaurant in New York City. I mean, it was a, it was exactly the same, even though it's no. run by blacks, <laughs> primarily uh, black patronship. It was the same. And the blacks were well-dressed. Bill O'Reilly has insisted he's not a racist. Decide for yourself. The left hates that, hates it. Because it is racial profiling, but it's really criminal profiling. In some African American communities, there is a grievance against whites who aren't sympathetic to their cause. Well, say you're a cocaine dealer, and you kind of look like one a little bit. Um, <laughs> As do you. You look like, like a cocaine user. There's an outreach, I don't even know what that means, by the Obama administration to African Americans. Right? Yeah. I don't know. What does that entail? Are they going to be on Soul Train? Now, that is pure racism 
Nothing else. I agree, Bill. It is pure racism. Let's bring in actor and activist George Takei here on The Ed Show tonight. Mr. Takei, great to have you with us. Uh, you, have got, you. Well, you have got an unbelievable following in the social media. People pay attention and look to you for your opinions and your response to things. Is Bill O'Reilly being racist? <laughs> Tonight's runner-up, Bill the Clown. After the arrest of Professor Gates, the Frank Burns of news went back to his excursion two years ago to meet some black people. Remember when I went up to Sylvia's and had dinner with Al Sharpton and said on my radio show, you know, Sylvia's is just like any other restaurant in America. It's a nice place with nice people. I got served great. And then the left wing turned it into I was denigrating, saying, oh, he didn't think Sylvia's was going to be nice. Yeah, that's, uh, that's not what you said. Billo on September 19th, 2007. I couldn't get over the fact that there was no difference between Sylvia's restaurant and any other restaurant in New York City. I mean, it was, it was exactly the same, even though it's run by blacks, primarily black patronship. It was the same, and that's really what this society is all about now. There wasn't one person in Sylvia's who was screaming, MFR, I want more iced tea. You know, I mean, everybody was, it was like going into an Italian restaurant, an all-white suburb, in the sense that people were sitting there, and they were ordering and having fun, and there wasn't any kind of craziness at all. Bill thought there might be a human sacrifice between the salad and the entree. Racist clown. Imagine dinner Shea Billow. I'm happily surprised you haven't stabbed me with a steak knife, dear. And I couldn't get over the fact, and I couldn't get over the fact that there was no difference between Sylvia's restaurant and any other restaurant in New York City. I mean, it was a, it was exactly the same, even though it's no. run by blacks, <laughs> primarily uh, black patronship. It was the same, and I couldn't get over the fact.